Okay, so we just uh, hiked in to our uh, nice little spot here in the mountains and we are loaded down with gear. I've got the uh, Super Mini with me. Got a nice uh, stool to uh, sit in while I uh, pan. I brought the uh, little uh, digger that I made. Try to uh, metal detect here in the woods. Also have the, uh, the old AT Pro out today. Uh, dig and shovel. I uh, got the MD-20 with me. I'll try to crack up some rock. Crack open some rock and see if I can uh, find any color. And Peter's got uh, the gold bug too. Got the lash digger. Uh, he's got the uh, fluid bed sluice he made pans. I uh, got the stool. Has the uh, mini dredge that he built. Buckets and other miscellaneous uh, gear. So time to Ready get some to good. Go in a creek. <laughs> Make it a little comfortable. Yes. Man, it's uh, no water. Yeah, no water. Yeah, we got some gold right here. I don't know if you can see, but yeah. Once I clean this up good, uh, we can run the dredge to your bazooka. I will try to make a hole too and see how deep we can go yeah. and maybe. Because I'm getting this kind of hole. Uh, this kind of hole. Yeah, and, but I think the gold is in it. Because it's also yeah, maybe the option. Oh, yeah, bottom layer. Yeah. If it's kind of greedy. No, I don't know how stuff like that you could dredge. You no, know? uh, you can't really. Unless you have like a load of dredge that would suck yeah, it up. Yeah. Right? Oh, I can see it from far, shiny big piece. So my uh, first three pans, I was skunked. Fourth pan, I get this big old piece right there. It's a real, real nice piece. It's got a lot of shape to it. It's kind of flat, but that's a great piece of gold right there. I'm working the uh, clay layer that I did in the uh, other video. And it's where the uh, creek is washing out this hard pack in the bank. And you got a uh, shallow clay layer where all the heavies uh, collect. And I'm just scraping it off with my hand. And it's just right here. It's not deep at all. It's a real shallow clay layer. And I'm able to work this material right here. Work it by hand. And with it being so clay heavy, you have to break it up really well to get the gold to release from the uh, clay. Just a uh, mineralized quartz rock. It's got the uh, white quartz, has the uh, black uh, iron deposits, also has uh, some mica. And it's got red, uh, looks like garnets in the rock. And this should be a uh, gold bearing type of rock. So me and Peter think the gold is probably, uh, this is probably a source of the gold here in this creek. Okay, let's see if this pan has any gold. Ah, oh, shit. What happened? The chair just broke. Oh, holy. Oh, damn it. Oh, look at that. Damn it, I'm in a different spot. What the heck? <laughs> I told you it was breaking, man. It's, <laughs> look at this. Piece of crap. It's what you get for a $5 stool. I'll put that at the end of the video. <laughs> get that little blue for real. I don't know if I can get that to work or not. You got your bucket though, right? Yeah, you use my bucket. bucket. Knock a bottle full of gold and you're breaking your chair. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> Don't tell me. <laughs> I know they laugh. Eureka. What the heck? Now that is chunky. You are on the spot. That is <laughs> a, a nice chunky piece. mother. <laughs>
Okay, so we've got a lot of the uh, same type of rock here. We'll take a little look-see. We got a little darker iron, maybe deposits in there. Okay, so we got the MD-20 here, and uh, I'm going to try running this on the clay. And the gold at all of this, you definitely need to run it right before you leave, you know. Oh, so yeah. you know you're not leaving one sticking out right there. But we're right on this bed right here. Yeah, it would sound off if you would be close to it. Oh! <laughs> that, that is good! <laughs> hey, let's uh, get your pen and... Hey, let's see. Let me go ahead and get hey. a scoop of that. You got some sound. Okay, so we got, a, we got a little hit here, sounds like, with the uh, MD-20. Let's see if we can... Let or... Go on. It's something is there. Where did it go? Let's see if we can find it again. Oh, that's loud! I like that. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho! Yeah. And it's sounding off going towards it, so that could be gold. Let me get it. Let's see here, it's kind of a little pocket. And that's the beauty about these electrodes, they will find those pockets that you cannot see or feel with your hand, you know? Yeah, that'd be great if that was gold. <laughs> oh, that would be great. Shovel that area out. See if it sounds off in here. You got something there. It's one of those iron heavy rocks, it could just be a I have to break that open. Really? Too. That's what it's sounding? Hey! Uh, take it at home. Ten grams. Sound good? Same thing. Same. You got there yeah. much feeling. But see, it's got that red iron. That may just be a. Oh, be off. Ah, that's what sounds an all. It may just be a hot rock. You have to crush it too long. Yeah, I can crush it up there. I see some nice little pieces showing through on the left. See your left. No, on the left right there, I saw a nice piece popping out. That's a good clean out, yeah. That's, uh, yeah. It's good. Yeah, good color. Okay, so uh, me and Peter, we're done here prospecting. And I uh, had a good day, and uh, Peter's having trouble with uh, floating gold. <laughs> it's floating everywhere. So there's uh, Peter's take. Some great looking gold. Great day of prospecting. Uh, my take. You should uh, pick your big piece of the thing.